In IIT Foundation Maths, in this video, I'll explain you the conversion of recurring decimals into vulgar fractions. Conversion of recurring decimals. First, you should know what is recurring decimals. So, what is called recurring and what is non recurring. So, let me explain first this recurring decimals. Then, you'll see how to convert them into the fractions or into the vulgar fractions recurring decimal so let the definition for this a decimal numerator A decimal number okay we'll take number a decimal number in which a, a digit or set of digits set of uh, digits repeats regularly over a constant period is called a recurring decimal or periodic decimal also you can call this so in some books as mentioned periodic decimal so we'll see what is this a decimal number in which a digit or set of digits repeats regularly for example taking some 2.333 repeated continuously so if you do one division so you'll find out this I am taking the example 1 divided by 3. Now 1 I should divide by 3. So it is a small. Keep 0 and put the point. Then 3, 3 is a 9. Remainder is 1. Again put 0. 3, 3 is a 9. Again the difference is 1. It will continuously keep on. So this you can write as 0 0.333 and repeat it. So, set of digits or a digit, digit or set of digits repeats regularly over a constant period. This is one type of example. Otherwise, you can take 18 point so 2, 3, 2, 3, 2, 3. A set of digits is 2323 2, 3 is repeated continuously. Now, these are recurring decimals. So, such type of recurring decimals, how we can convert into the uh, vulgar fraction? See this example 1 by 3 is equals to 0 0.333 so on. If they will give 1 by 3 we can write this because by doing division. Now if they will give in the question itself recurring decimal how we can convert into the vulgar fraction. So there are two type of recurring decimals. So I will explain you now. The one type is pure recurring decimal. So these two types I'll explain you how to convert them into vulgar fractions. Okay, now first part type is pure recurring decimal. Now this is the simple one. That means same digits will be repeated only after point that means we can take it example like 0 0.7777 so on so after point immediately start repeats set of digits otherwise 0 0.545454 like this so such type of examples are pure recurring decimals that means after point soon after decimal the digits will repeated continuously 
set or else digit also now these type we can convert easily into the vulgar fraction okay you take the previous example only that is 0 0.777 it is repeated right we can write this is 0 0.7 bar that meaning is that 7 is repeating then we can take that 7 divided by we still keep 9 how many digits are repeated that many 9s will keep in the denominator place so 7 by 9 if you do division you get exactly 0 0.77 repeats you can check it is 7 divided by 9 0 point because small again 97 63 again remainder is 7 put 0 again 97 63 so it repeats continuously now the one more example is 0 0.5454 so on that we can write 0 0.54 bar and hyphen that bar you should keep how many digits are repeated then we can take it right as 54 by 99 because two digits are repeated here so how many digits are repeated that means nines in the denominator place we can keep as a number of digits in the period of decimal number before the given num decimal number okay so these are the pure recurring decimals now one more type is mixed recurring decimals if the repetition is mixed then how them we can convert into the vulgar fractional explain in shortcut method second type is mixed recurring decimals so let me write what type of this examples here uh, 0 0.1 now 77 7 is repeated this we can write 0 0.17 bar only 7 is repeating there is one more example 0 0.8 or 873 7373 7, 3 repeats this we can write 0 0.873 so the bar is only on 73 these type of examples are mixed recurring decimals okay now this type of how we can convert into vulgar fraction so I'll explain some simple formula now 0 0.17 bar that is first numerator place we should write without point without any bar without point I means without decimal without bar the number is 17 so don't consider this bar and decimals just write the complete number here minus then without the repeated the remaining number is 1 so we should not consider the decimal on the bar which is repeated so non repeating numbers so don't consider the decimal at all the complete number is 17 and without this 7 the remaining is 1 divide by 10 to the power number of digits after point there are two minus 10 to the power number of digits after point which are non recur that is one okay after point there are number of digits are two because one and seven seven is repeated okay but overall the digits are one and seven two minus again 10 to the power number of digits after point which are non recur seven is recurring one is not one now this if we simplify that is our answer 17 minus 1 is 16 10 square 100 minus 10 so 16 by 90 you can simplify 8 by 45 now this is the vulgar fraction of 0 0.17 bar okay let me write uh, explain for the second example also that is 0. 873 so bar is on 73 now according to our formula principle without point without bar just number without point without bar number is 8 
hundred and seventy three because bar is on seven three minus non repeated number is eight. Don't consider the decimal part because the point should not consider eight seventy three minus eight by ten to the power number of digits after point three are there eight seven minus 10 to the power number of digits after point which are non recur is only one that is eight so only one now this is 865 by 10 power 3 is 1000 1000 minus 12 is 990 if you simplify okay five table you can cancel Five nine eight five table one 73 so 173 by 198 now this is the number so finally we what we can write formula for this the total number we can take first total number we should not consider any decimal or any bar so no point are non trigger so no repetition so nothing we should take minus that non repeated number non repeated number will take by 10 to the power number of digits after decimal that means only after point minus 10 to the power same number of non recurring digits non recurring digits we can take one for last for one more example I'll explain you zero one point two three bar now listen here 1.23 bar but only bar is on 3 now I can't formula total number without point without any bar that is 123 minus 12 because completely non repeated so don't consider the point on the numerator that is important by 10 to the power how many digits are there after point 2 are there 2 and 3 so 2 minus 10 to the power number of non repeated only 1 so 2 and 3 are number of digits non repeated is only 2 only after point that is 1 so 123 minus 12 1 1 1 by 100 minus 10 that is 90 3 30 is a it is a 9, 7 is a 21. So 37 by 30 is the vulgar fraction of 1.23 bar. The bar is on 3. Now this is a shortcut method you can apply for any uh, mixed recurring decimals. We can use this method. Okay, I hope you understood well. And one more important thing is you can subscribe this channel because we will completely upload only the videos which are linked with the educational and IIT foundation and the, some more problems if you want to see uh, which are related to this fractions in foundation for IIT.com so in this website you can find out every information from which is related to ICSC, CBSC, SSC and Inter apart from that the students who are writing any competitive exams there's a plenty of videos and complete uh, material which is uh, completely free so go to this website at the same time uh, uh, subscribe this channel so i hope you understood well thank you for watching this video